what I eat in a day as a vegan video. <laughs> in these videos, I really like to share the recipes for them so that you can enjoy them at home. So those will be down in the description box below. And if you do decide to try any, make sure to tag me on Instagram at Amanda Ducks um, so that I can see your creations at home as well. With all that being said, let's get into the video. This is what I eat in a day and I hope you enjoy. Okay, so for breakfast this morning, I started my day with a cacao PB smoothie as per usual. This one I had with ice as well as frozen bananas and vanilla protein. Then I also added in cacao powder as well as maca powder, which I am loving at the moment. Then I added peanut butter, of course, as well as some hemp seeds. I'm loving hemp seeds in my smoothies at the moment. Then I finished it off with some soy milk before putting the lid on top and blending it all together. And I had a beautiful little spectator this morning, as you can see. From there, I poured my smoothie up. As you can see, it's nice and smooth and creamy. And that is what I started my day with. At about 11.30, I got hungry, so I made myself a vegan big brekkie kind of thing. First of all, in a pan, I started with some oil as well as the little bit of kale that I had left and a whole bunch of spinach. I put some pink salt as well as some nutritional yeast with this, and then I just fried it all up until it was nice and wilted. Whilst it was frying, I then sliced some cherry tomatoes into halves and I put these into a pan with some oil, of course. And then I added on some pink salt as well as garlic powder and black pepper and I fried these up until they were nice and well done. After that, I put some chickpea tempeh into the same pan with some oil and I put some barbecue sauce on top and fried this up to make a delicious barbecue tempeh. And then we get to the plating. So I've got two pieces of some toast and then I topped it with smashed avocado. I added my wilted greens as well as my fried garlic cherry tomatoes and my barbecue tempeh. Then I just topped this with some fresh spring onion as well as sesame seeds and then also some uh, lime and then also alfalfa. And this was a really a really delicious vegan big brekkie that I enjoyed for lunch. Definitely recommend making one of these at home. From there at like 4.30, I decided to make myself dinner, if you can call it dinner. Uh, I started by cooking some rice in my rice cooker and whilst it was cooking, I made some tempeh and some broccoli. So I just put some chick chickpea tempeh onto a baking tray with oil as well as sesame seeds and salt. I love putting sesame seeds on my tempeh and baking it. And then on the broccolini, I put some oil as well as salt and garlic and I baked this in the oven for like 20 to 25 minutes until it was nice and crispy. Whilst that was baking I made a satay sauce with some water as well as maple syrup. Then I also added in garlic powder as well as salt and pepper and then I put in a whole bunch of peanut butter and I mixed this together whilst it like boiled and thickened and I had a really really nice satay sauce to have with my dinner. Then it came to the plating and I put some rice into a bowl followed by cos lettuce that I chopped finely as well as my baked broccolini and my baked sesame tempeh. Then I drizzled satay sauce on top and added fresh spring onions as well as sesame seeds. And this was a really nourishing and delicious uh, end to my day. But then I decided to have a hot cacao. Hot cacao I've been really enjoying now that we're getting into the warmer months here in Australia. And I just put some soy milk as well as maple syrup, cacao powder and maca powder over the heat and I whisk it together. It gets nice and frothy and blended and delicious. And yeah, this is a really, really beautiful way to end the day. With a warm, nourishing, 
hot cacao. Alrighty, my beautiful friends. So that is everything that I ate in a day as a vegan. Thank you so much as always for being here and for supporting me and my YouTube channel. I appreciate it so very much. I will be back very soon with another video and I will see you then. Have a beautiful day. Bye.